Yeah, you good. All right, guys. So right now, what we're about to do is I'm about to kick it off with one of my favorite. I've been trying to record this exercise for you guys for a while, but haven't had the time to. Or just couldn't. Um, weighted pull-ups. The first exercise we're going to start with is going to be weighted pull-ups. You guys, stay tuned. Alright guys, I haven't did a voiceover in a while, but I just want to do a quick voiceover. Even though you see what I put on the screen to let you know what we're doing, I've been wanting to do weighted pull-ups to show you guys, um, once you get used to your own body weight, move up in weight, it's just going to make your back stronger, uh, a bigger back, add some resistance on there, that's all you got to do. Uh, even, it don't have to be too heavy of a weight, 10 pounds, 12 pounds, as long as you progress up, that's all you need. Did some lap pullovers for four sets it's in not too many people do this exercise or not too many people that i see in the gym do this exercise usually uh, if you lay horizontally across the bench it's used for a chest workout um but i do like to lay vertically across the bench and it's it's still working a little bit of my of my upper chest but you can actually definitely feel it in your lats and that's why they call it a lat pullover because you can definitely feel it in your lats. So me and Justin did this for four sets of 10. Like I said, I don't see too many people uh, trying this in the gym, but switch up your routine. It's always good to go into the gym and switch up your routine every now and again. That way your body doesn't become complacent because you never want your body to become complacent. And then, you know, you'll start seeing um, you start hitting a plateau. That's why it's always good to switch up your routine. So if you're tired of doing lat pull downs or low rows, give this a try. Switch it up. All right. Justin did do overhead tricep extensions for a set of 12. We were pretty heavy. I got up to the 70 pound dumbbells. I would have reached the 80s or even 85s, but my triceps were just burnt out at that point. So, um, you, uh, basically for the triceps, you just want to pump a lot of blood into the muscle, a lot of volume, a lot of sets and reps. So if, if you do four sets of 15, four sets of 12, five sets of 10, five sets of 15, as long as you're getting that volume and those sets and reps in there, you'll watch your triceps grow and get stronger because the triceps can handle a lot of weight. So do that and get that horseshoe action.
then me and Justin did do some tricep kickbacks for four sets of 15. Actually, we were gonna superset this with the overhead tricep extensions, but we decided to say just fuck it and make it a separate exercise, but another good tricep exercise to pump a lot of blood into the muscle. Another one of my favorite tricep exercises, weighted dips. We, uh, me and Justin did this for four sets of 12 as well. Um, if you lean a little bit forward, yes, you're gonna work some of your chest um, as a decline for chest dips, but the main focus and the main goal was, uh, just like the other tricep workouts, was to pump as much blood into the muscle as possible and get those reps and that volume in there. Also, when you're doing volume exercises, you want to minimize rest time as much as possible. This was the last exercise, uh, the last back exercise that me and Justin did do for the day. Cable bent over rows. Now I know a lot of people use the barbell. I don't see too many people using the cable for bent over rows, but it's definitely a different variation from the barbell. I like it because I can feel it like in my, in my lats and my middle back. So that's why I like to use it sometimes. I like to switch on and off from the barbell to the cable. It's really good. We, uh, me and Justin just did it for four sets of 12. If you've always used the barbell for bent over row, don't be afraid, man. Get it, uh, use the cable and give it a try. Uh, if you do give the cable bent over row a try, comment down below and tell me what you think. Some people might like the barbell bent over row better than the cable or vice versa. So that's that was our last exercise. So that was it guys, me and Justin did uh, back and triceps today. Uh, I really want to get a lot more footage, but you know with games police around, I didn't really get the footage that I wanted, but I did get the workouts that I really wanted to show you guys as far as like the weighted pull-ups. I've been waiting for a while to show you guys that one, even though you guys may have already uh, heard me mention in a previous video or something rather, or seen me do it on Instagram or something like that. Uh, I really want to show you guys that. Also the weighted chest dips, uh, well actually the triceps. Uh, the weighted, uh, just the weighted dips, even though you can use it for triceps, it's actually just the weighted dips. Um, and then we did some cable bent over rows. You don't also have to use the barbell, but you can use just the cable to do it. Different variation, hitting it from a different angle. Um, I actually feel it in my lats a little bit uh, better than using the barbell. Some people may prefer the, the barbell over the cable. Some people don't even know about the cable, but I did, I did want to show you guys that you don't don't only have to use a barbell, you can use a cable. Also, I want to show you guys the lat pullovers that I was doing laying down, me and Justin. Not too many people do it anymore. Some, uh, I know uh, a lot of the old bodybuilders like Arnold and Kai Green still use it, but they lay across the bench. I was actually laying uh, vertical. Uh, usually people lay horizontal, and they, they use it for actually a chest workout, but it can also be used for lats. So that's what we did as well. Then we killed triceps. Uh, I did notice tricep strength is going up. So also, uh, if you guys want to give that a try, the overhead, uh, feel free to, uh, when you're doing triceps, the overheads, uh, go as heavy as possible. The triceps can stand a lot of weight, so we tried to go as heavy as possible today. Uh, hit the 70s, I was going to hit the 80s, but my triceps were just too burnt out, so that was it. Um, I'm going to try to do a, a couple of vlog videos for you guys, something a little bit new, something a little bit different. Um, I don't really track my macros and calories and things like that, but I can make, I really don't want to make a, uh, like a day of eating video but I can show you guys what I eat and what's in my diet what's in my current diet of what I'm intaking daily <coughs> also uh, the most viewed video on my YouTube channel is what's in my supplement stack so I'll be updating what's in my supplement stack pretty soon show you guys the new supplements that I'm taking whatnot I'm gonna go ahead and get on out of here me and Justin killed him today let's flex on him mm.